Xavier Porter, Shoot the Fire, Brooklyn Fights Live and Direct with the one and only Mr. Jesse Vargas, world champion Jesse Vargas. How you feeling today? Feeling well. Uh, we're here at the, the Left Kid vs. Rolls press conference and, uh -huh. you know, promoting the fight. It will be on the zone on Saturday night. Seems to be uh, one of the interesting, interesting fights of the month. Uh -huh. And um, looking forward to it. Last week. Come on, brother. I need your thoughts on last week. Yeah, I mean, uh, we got a major upset. <laughs> yeah. Andy Reese came in, uh, willing to die inside that ring, as he said, prior to the fight. And he showed that, you know, he had all the intention of winning mm -hmm. you know, with, with the victory. Mm -hmm. Now, you know, there's a lot of hype. It's a lot of been back and forth said on social media that they feel like, you know, Anthony Joshua wasn't up to it in a sense mentally, maybe physically, some things might have been taking place in camp. What are your thoughts on everything that took place that night and after? I don't know what happened in camp, so yeah. I can elaborate on that, but yeah. I can say that that Anthony came to fight, he came to win. Mm -hmm. He was fast, he was explosive in the beginning. Mm -hmm. He caught Andy Reese in the beginning with a big hook. Nice hook, yeah. Which you know what? It was they were exchanging hooks at yeah. that moment. It's just Anthony Joshua's hook came in first, mm -hmm. dropped Andy Reese. Yeah. He came in for the kill, which was right in the middle distance. Uh -huh. You know, the distance that Andy Reese could also let, let his punches go. Uh -huh. But once you let Andy Reese uh, come into that distance, you're in a lot of danger. Mm -hmm. because of the speed, mm -hmm. the velocity in his punches, mm -hmm. and of course the punching power. And when and Anthony Joshua went in for the kill, he was also receiving punches. They were exchanging blows, mm -hmm. and that's what uh, hurt and Anthony Joshua. He was hurt right away, mm -hmm. but a lot of people didn't notice it. And then he continued fighting on. Mm -hmm. He was hit with another two punches. It was a uh, right hook. Left and a left hook, yeah. yeah. Right? He was hurt again. Yeah. All right, this is the third time. Mm -hmm. uh, I'd say the second time he was hurt mm -hmm. in, in the round. And then Anthony Joshua continues to fight. And he gets hit with another big right hand mm -hmm. right over the top because he, his balance was already off. Yeah. And he goes down. Mm -hmm. So he knew he was hurt, but he was still fighting. Yeah. Four seconds. You know, and uh, that was uh, prior to the first knockdown. Then he gets knocked down. Mm -hmm. And then uh, he gets back up. And, of course, and Andy Ruiz gets in the distance that is convenient for him. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, drops him again. But... Anthony Joshua, I give him credit because he didn't give up. Just like that. He got up four times. Try getting knocked out once. Yeah. He get up. Yeah. You Big dude, I mean? six six, probably two eighty fight night. You know. Credit you know? no matter what. Yeah. I mean, Andy Reese possesses uh, a lot of danger for a lot of these heavyweights. Mm -hmm. you know? he, I, I personally think um, he, right now, I thought Anthony Joshua was the best fighter in the division. Yeah. He was. Mm -hmm. But Andy Reese comes in. Apparently, you know, Andy Reese had everything to. To uh, defeat him, and he did. Mm -hmm. Now Andy Reese is on top of the division, but they have a rematch clause, so I'm looking forward to that one. Do you think he's the best right now? Do you think Andy Ruiz is number one in the division? Sure, you beat the, Over uh, Wilder. You beat the number one guy. You're number one. Got gotcha. you. You know how many belts does he have? Four. Um, Four, I believe, right? I mean, he's yeah. not undefeated. Yeah. But it's a fight that that I think he, he should have won. I think they should have gave him the decision. But you go to someone else's hometown. Mm -hmm. You know. Andy Reese has taken chances, mm -hmm. you know, has taken risks that no one else has. You know, he goes to other people's hometown. Went to Australia you know, for Joe Parker. Comes to NYC, yeah. you know, at Madison Square Garden. He, he, this wasn't his home. Yeah. Neither was Joshua's, but it was more Joshua's than, you know what I mean? Yeah. Perfect, perfect fight for Joshua to display his ability for, mm -hmm. the, for the American audience. So it was set for him. Andy Reese didn't care to anything twice. He said, just give me the opportunity. Mm -hmm. That's all I need. And look what happened. You know, I give him nothing but credit. You know, I applaud Andy Reese for his victory. And now, um, you know, we have a new Mexican world gonna, champion in the mm -hmm. heavyweight division. Credit to him. Mm -hmm. Making history. It's, 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 it's huge, man. But, uh, I mean, people need to understand that, you know, these heavyweight fighters, not even just fighters in general, mm -hmm. it's rare the fighter doesn't have heart, doesn't have the bravery to stay inside that ring. Once you get up, once yeah. you step up those, the stairs, you know, inside the ring, you know, a lot of them will, will try to do everything possible to come out with the victory. Mm -hmm. Anthony Joshua was knocked out four times. Mm -hmm. I don't know about his training camp. I can't speak on it. Gotcha. You know, but I can speak on what I saw. Mm -hmm. Anthony Joshua was willing to to uh, engage several in several occasions, mm -hmm. was trying, but the speed that Andrew Reese possessed was a little was was. Um, very, very difficult for him to adapt to that speed. Mm -hmm. and, I mean, this is boxing. Anything can happen. Mm -hmm. And as Triple, as Triple G says, you know, it's a big drama show. <laughs> so, uh, we might see a big drama show this Saturday night. Yeah. The Love Kid. We have Rose. Yeah. You know, 
two fighters that are very hungry and who knows, you might you might have another upset. You just never know. Rose mm -hmm. has everything to make the fight. Yeah. To, make, to take advantage of this, of this opportunity and come out with the victory. What are your thoughts on the rematch between Joshua and um, Ruiz? I think it's a good fight. I, I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm signing myself off. I'm on. Okay. On, okay, on. To be there, you know, uh, Undercard or just to be there as a, to support? To be there to support mm -hmm. because, uh, yeah, to be there to support. For <laughs> okay. Yeah. I mean, I will be fighting. I'll be fighting in September. Okay. And then I uh, will hope to come back in December once again. So uh, even though, even if I'm in training camp, you yeah. know, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to miss it. I'm going to gotcha. watch it on TV. Everybody subscribe to The Zone. Mm -hmm. You know, it's uh, we have several fights going down, over 100 fights, you know, uh, combats, you know, and on The Zone. So tune in, subscribe, and I highly recommend it. We have a lot of good shows, and if you speak Spanish, <laughs> tune, in, tune in to the Spanish channel. We have me, we have... Renato Bermude, got a great team. Carlos Selly, all yeah. these fellas that are uh, doing an amazing job, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, live the moment. Now, when you made the decision to go to Matchroom, how did that, you know, what went through the process of that? And as well as the decision to go to... Negotiations. Yeah. All negotiations. And then uh, we negotiated, we confirmed, and mm -hmm. now we're in Matchroom. And, uh, you know, uh, we just lived up a fantastic moment mm -hmm. with uh, Anthony Joshua and Andy Reese. Yeah. And... The sky's the limit, man. You know, I'm continuing to push forward. Now, when you made the decision to go to 154, what was that about? I was it like, you gotcha? Yeah, I can't make it wait. Yeah. difficult, man. I'm, thank God I moved up. <laughs> I got and you. Now I feel more comfortable. Yeah. Uh, I feel stronger as well. Mm -hmm. You know, my body's just responding much better. And I also have a good team with me now. You know, yeah. I have Brady Roach. Uh, nothing but credit to him. Mm -hmm. all the fame Stack division. That's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. Yeah, if there is a competition, then, yeah. you know, uh, we think twice about moving up. But, I mean, we have heard. We have uh, the Charlo. Not the Charlo. Yeah. Brother, but one of the Charlos. Yeah. Who's a, a talented fighter. J-Rock. Tony Harrison. You know. Like Champion, you know. Harrison. It's a stacked division. Man. We also have Jaime Munguia. Also, now, how would that be? You two guys match it up all Mexican war right there, you know? Man, we could possibly make a <laughs> similar to a Pereira versus Morales. Fight, yeah. You know I mean, you never yeah. know. I mean, we need those fights. Absolutely. You know what I mean? and yeah. That's why we can possibly give it to the fans. Uh, we're trying to make the fight happen. We'll, we'll, we'll so you do want to have you. You do want Jaime McGee. I mean, anyone with the title. Got you, Tony Harrison has a title, so, you yeah. know, I'm keeping an eye out on them. But he's fighting uh, Charles Sue. When he come back, yeah. yeah Hopefully, yeah. yeah. And then you have, uh, I was I mean, heard. Yeah. Heard, I was going to say something else, but you know, I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> heard, and then you also have uh, J-Rock. J-Rock, who yeah. just became a champion. Brian, Brian Castano. Yeah, Brian what? Castano. Oh, I think he's from Argentina, I believe. Argentina, yeah. correct. Arizona yeah. Lara, he doesn't have a belt, but you know he's still a. He has an international like, WBA okay. belt. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean it's a fight that can happen. Yeah. No, I mean honestly, I think that the fight fans are more eager to see Monkey of Argus. It's just, yeah. Um, That's a fact. What, they know what it would bring. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll, well, thank you for your time, Jesse yeah, Vargas. Uh, Instagram again. Yeah, Jesse Vargas underscore Jesse with an IE. Twitter. Thank you for all the support. All right. Thanks again, man.